Hey YouTube, this is Crazy Skull 88. This is my first video, and uh, this video is going to be about how to fix the Wi Fi problem on your Cruise Tablet T408. Okay, the problem with this um, tablet that we're having is actually the Wi Fi, it keeps going on and off. If you see that right now, the Wi Fi is actually off in this tablet. Well, right now it came on, but it wasn't working before. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to fix it. This is the model T408. Okay, so go. let's go ahead and fix it. Okay, first thing you have to do is actually go through, you know, to your browser. You can use Firefox. It's a lot easier. Then, you're going to go through the Cruise Tablet website. So you type cruisetablet.com. Once you go through, through cruisetablet.com, you're going to click on support right here. Once you click on support, you're going to slide the page down and you're going to see right here where it says Prime Wire Update. Okay? Now, it's easy. So you just got to choose whatever model you have. I have the T408, so I'm going to choose, uh, you know, the T408. Click on Download. Once you click on Download, it's going to take you to the next page. The next page is going to give you the instructions, the screenshots, the how to do it. So it doesn't really specify, you know, how to do it, but it gives you the instructions. So you just want to slide down to step number two, where it says download the file, you know, the update file. So on your right hand side, you're going to see the T408 prime wire, newest. Okay, so you want to click on that option, and it's, you, you know you want to save it. You want to download that op to that file to your desktop. I already have it, so I'm gonna download it anyways, so that you can see what I'm doing. Okay, now it just uh, we we just have to wait for the file to finish to download. Okay, just give it a second. It's almost there. Another thing, once you download the file, you can put the file either on the internal memory or on the cruise tablet, on the root. You know, you, you gotta put it on the root. You, you don't have to put it on any folder. You can just put it in the first thing you see, you know, on the blank space. Um, otherwise, you can just put it on your SD card. It doesn't really matter. You can use either one. So once the, down the file is downloaded, you're gonna go to your computer and um, I'm using the micro SD card so I go ahead and go through my computer and see the file is already downloaded I'm sorry okay the file is already downloaded and you're gonna go to your computer once you go to my computer you're gonna open the wherever if you have the you know the the cruise tablet connected with USB or or the micro SD card. I have the micro SD card, so I'm gonna open it, and you're gonna see all these folders right here, all these files. And right here, as you can see, that's the file I already download. I already have it here because, like I say, I already did this process. So you just, you know, copy this file, then you paste the file right here I'm doing the same process but I already have it on my on my tablet so I'm just letting you know <laughs> okay once the file is there I'll go ahead and remove it <laughs> I'm gonna remove it because I already have it once again okay once the file is there you're gonna uh, go through your cruise tablet once you go you gotta make sure that your cruise tablet is off okay so I'm uh, just give me one second please I'm right here I'm because I'm using the micro SD card I go ahead and put that SD card to my tablet okay it's in so let's go ahead and turn off the cruise tablet. Okay, and power off. Are you sure you want to turn it off? 
So you you are sure. <laughs> okay, so right now it's going now. It's gonna take a second. Okay. Once it's off, this is very important steps. Do you see that the button? Well, you don't really see them because it's just a black color. But you have three buttons. You have the power button. You have the volume up, volume down. See? Well, you don't really see that. But uh, so you're gonna. The first thing you're gonna do is press the power um, button and the volume up at the same time, like in the iPhone. So you press the power button and the up button together. Once you see the cruise tablet logo, you wanna let go. Okay, once you let go that option, it's gonna give you this uh, little droid warning. So to install the application we just download or the prime wire, you're gonna press again power and the volume up, uh, volume up at the same time, just really quick. Give me a second. Okay. Once you press them. It's gonna take you to the root of the tablet. So right here we're gonna search for, you know, for the uh, file we just download, and uh, I downloaded on the root of the, you know, of this um, um, SD card. See what it's uh, well right now it says apply object from external SD card so you choose that one you can move with the volume up or down so you choose the SD card option I don't know if you can really see them so and then to apply that option you're gonna press the ball the power button one time only one time okay so right now it's gonna take you to the SD card once you're in the SD card you're gonna see the you see it right there it says cruise MB Cruise underscore T408. So that's the upgrade or the the frying wire update. So to choose that one, you're gonna move um, with the volume buttons. You can do down. It's gonna move you down. And then to install the application, you're just gonna press the power up. You're gonna you're just gonna press the power button. I'm sorry you just gonna press the power to do the enter so when it's doing that it's gonna say installing okay now we, we just let it finish installing the program it's gonna be really quick it just takes a few minutes to do it and this is a hundred percent guarantee it's gonna work because I opened my tablet and I thought it was maybe the antenna Wi-Fi, uh, you know, the Wi-Fi antenna wasn't working or something got um, messed up in there, but it wasn't really anything to do with the antenna. It was only the frying wire. It, for some reason, it just it stopped working. So the velocity micro, they were having these problems. So they make the you know the update to to fix it and it worked okay so right now it was successful as you can see right here it says the the update was already installed okay so now I give you the option right here the first one is already there it says reboot system now so you're gonna press the power button one time only to reboot the system and it's gonna reboot okay so right now it lets it's going to take a little bit longer to reboot the system. Oh, well, okay. It's loading right now. It has to recognize the, the prime wire to fix the problem with the Wi-Fi. Okay, still loading, guys. Takes a little bit longer because it has to load all the files and make sure that you know 
the frame wire is gonna work I'm gonna leave the tablet here like that you can see this it, it, this really works mine was working already but I'll do I did it again anyway like that you can see you know that it's really working and how to do it step by step okay already make the, the noise that means that it's already in and as you can see again the Wi-Fi is there so that means the Wi-Fi is working so if you try to do this on your own you are going to be able to fix your tablet you don't really have to return it or you don't really have to do anything else so see the Wi-Fi is, wor is working so you can turn it off and turn it on again just to make sure see the option right here it says off and it disappears on give it a second it's recognizing the IP address and see there you go still working so I'm going to go ahead and put the link on the description below okay so make sure that you check this video and I think it's the only one and please I you know please um, enjoy the video and I hope you like it peace